hello welcome back viewers in this uh, lecture we will be working uh, or this area I mean the sidebar so we need to go to the source code this is basically the style file styler CSS and this is the main index file so basically we have to work or uh, here in the sidebar so I have removed the text and basically this is the the you know the place we need to work on so the first thing is first which is actually basically adding uh, a DI VTEC and making a, a class over here or ID for example ID and I will say side bar underscore title this will be a title I mean for showing something so I will say categories I have added the title as categories and will simply close this over here div take div close and we need to create this id sidebar underscore title to make this text better or beautiful first of all i have saved it oh i have saved using control s come here refresh you can see this is a text over here very normal text we need to make it according to the design very simply uh, we'll come over here below the sidebar we'll create the ID over here sidebar underscore title that we already added there two scarly brackets inside two scarly brackets we will write its style I mean add the properties the CSS properties so the first will be the background color that will be basically white absolutely white and second will be the color of the text which will be black of course after this uh, text align will be I uh, mean font underscore size will be 22 pixel and uh, font family will be Palatino this is I mean uh, this will be basically Arial. Okay, control is to save this. We have already added it here. You can see di we take id sidebar underscore title and categories. We have saved it. Press it. So you see something like this. Oh, we need to also add some padding for example 10 pixel control s you will see some changes now I mean some distance uh, it is basically bordering or absolutely at the corner of the actual location so it will make some distance you know now it is looking better I think of course it's looking better so we have added this uh, uh, now in just after it will create another div take this id will be cats yeah of course we need to add some cats over here this will be closed over here below that now inside it we add you will take same like above basically we don't need actually this div take we can directly do it by you will take So that's simple. Inside the D uh, UL tag, we can insert same like you know, like we created the menu, the navigation bar, li tag, li close. UL is a tag always used for uh, unordered list, and inside the UL tag, we always use li tags. I mean list item. So for menus, for creating menus and adding links designers mostly use these takes inside li we will add some demi links html links we'll add some text for example these are basically categories so categories might be laptops and now we'll just copy this whole line we'll paste it again again 
and six times laptops will just change the names to computers mobiles and uh, cameras and uh, for example to iPads and tablets that's it control is to save and now you come over here to refresh your page you will see these links over here but basically these links are same like we first of all added these links we need to style up them using CSS just will come to style.css file and remember that we have added the cats ID already so we need to create the cats ID inside the CSS file just after the sidebar title we just create it we'll create another ID cats inside the two curly brackets can style it up the very simple thing for this will be uh, Cats padding will be zero, and inside the cats we have li take. We actually need to style up that list underscore uh, sorry list day style will be none, and uh, display will be. block this time not inline now after this we need to say a rub I mean the anchor text inside the cats ID will have a color white and padding 8 pixel and margin 5 pixel and uh, text align center set control s to save we have simply added some styles to this id refresh it and you see they um, they are here but not uh, not as we wanted them so we need to remove this display and color white is okay padding it is okay text align center control s to save and check out it again Mm -hmm. uh, color white oh sorry need to add some font size <coughs> font size will be we'll remove this one font size will be 18 pixel and font family will be I mean some kind of comic sense MS Control S to save come over here press the page and you see the font size is now bigger than the previous one but they're not uh, actually coming over here that is the problem In the center Okay, remove this uh, padding and uh, I mean padding in margin so first we need to make it center align after that we will work further text align center oh sorry I have to again edit uh, I need to again edit that this thing I mean the main ID gates text align I should add from here text align center control s to save now it will be centered align press it now you can see it's centered align so we have removed actually the size from here but I will add again and text decoration will be none we didn't need it before and uh, font family will be something like uh, comic comic science ms that's it 
control s to save now you will see it is b absolutely okay what however we want it we can uh, increase its size to 20 that's up to us uh, just save the page and now you can see these are the categories basically so we have we actually did a mistake or here we needed to add the text align or here because this is basically inside that main uh, I mean main section this gets div division is actually inside that or here inside this sidebar so therefore we needed this to make this cats main id align center that's okay now we can simply add uh, one more cats a hover one more style which will be hover so after when someone hover it so it will say orange color and uh, font weight will be bolder and text decoration will be underlined yeah that's it control s to save come over here refresh your page and see uh, okay one thing more we can make some more I uh, mean margin for example 10 between the links Control S to save. Come here, refresh. So this, okay. Use this one actually. Fifteen as the padding, basically. Refresh it. No, that is not actually the problem. The padding and the margin are okay here. Uh, we can uh, actually make margin over here margin 5 pixel for li tag so two li tags will make some difference yeah you can see now there is some distance between two li tags because this is a different scenario than the menu that we created above I mean this is different than this menu so we need to work on the this as well I mean the li tag now very simply come back to index.php page and simply copy this whole thing okay from here the sidebar title to there's all links and ul tag and everything and paste it just below it here change this one to brands and here you can just add hp these are basically brands but temporary we will actually uh, call dynamically from the database we will call these brands and categories from uh, I mean from our database and upcoming tutorials Motorola Sony Ericsson and uh, LG and Apple these are basically brands control s to save come here push and you see brands are also here these are categories and these are brands you can add more to the brands as well as the categories but in next video we are gonna work on or this this place I mean okay this is centered aligned but this is not what is the reason uh, that is not what is the reason the reason is because we have uh, this is text align center so we can make this also text align center so both will be centered align that's it control s to save come back press the page and you see this is also align centered and another one also anyways next video we are coming back 
and working on uh, this area writing products so that will we will start the dynamic work between the page and the database so we first will need to create the database for this project and inside the database some tables basically stay tuned <coughs> 